Hello, love. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Fuck. Tell me why TikTok has um, told me that I can upload 30 minute videos like five times today and I, I keep having to click on the notification to make it go away and it's so annoying. Anyways, smile for TikTok! Why zero for fuck's sake? <laughs> okay, guys, I don't know what's wrong with my lighting right now. Okay, let me see if that fixes. 
next. Ready? Who's ready to see my ugly mug? That's my new phrase. Hi, chat. Hi, guys. I'm wearing a new shirt. Um, I was sad because I thought it was a full button down, but it, like, it, like, stops. But it's actually fun to wear open anyway. Though this tank top, this tank top has gotta go. It's way too fucking small. Get buttoned on, stop man? Fuck you. The reason for the title, guys, is because I have to have a poem for my class tomorrow, and I haven't picked one yet. Tank top, stop copying my fashion? I'm not copying your fashion. Just realized my mic was way too high. What kind of poem we talking? Oh. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I died in slow motion, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck you, Jacob. Thanks, Day Day. Roses are red, violets are blue. I'd like to be inside of you. Why'd we say that like Mario? I'd like to be inside of you. Ew. Ew. Fuck you. Sorry, I always say fuck you to anyone who kills me. Why are you so dressed up tonight? Um for funsies. I was actually gonna take pictures today, but I didn't because my shorts are ugly. If we want, I'll do a fit chat. Let me scroll back up. What kind of poem are we talking? Oh, I'm the only one who can wear wife beaters. No, you're not, Bushka. What kind of poem are we talking? So it's a poem for a project where I'm gonna have to storyboard the story of the poem, so it has to be something you can, like, visualize. But I thought you guys could help me pick a poem. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that reminds me I need to move that. Um, hang on. It's still behind the thing. No, no, stop. There we go. Okay. Hey, Day Day. Your neck keeps getting less and less flexible. That's so real. This is why I never do poems. Always ends in death. Date? No, I wish. You should turn that up, the metal pipe. It's already all the way up, I think. Oh wait, it's actually not. But if I turn it all the way up, it gets distorted and like all of the other sounds get fucked up. Does modern poetry count or we need to do ancient, ancient boring ones? I think you can do modern ones. They just have to be like accessible. Like I have to be able to like send a link to my teacher so it can't just be like a TikTok. You know what I mean? Like it has to be like available in like a written format on like a blog or something. Didn't bring all the ladies to the stream? What? My shirt? No. I made a project about a BLM poem for literature class. Okay. Date? Want to go on a Minecraft date? We can put our beds together. Why are you flirting with me, Spiffy? <laughs> the cute bisexual girl. Oh. I thought you had a plan. Guys, can we stop... <laughs> can we stop talking about... Attracting girls to the stream? I'm, you're making me embarrassed. No, no cat ears. No cat ears, okay? No cat ears. I'm bored and on a bus going to a tap bed. Do cute pansexual girls count? Because if so, I have arrived. Christina! Christina! Yes! Yes, yes they do count. Yeah, that will make them go away. If you want to steal my project idea, shit was fire. But the only thing is I have to be able to draw it. And it has to, like, tell a story. What was your poem like? How did it go? No, Christina, don't leave! Oh, my music's still loud. No one told me. No, Christina, don't leave! 
Oh right, you don't call it taffe, you call it university. Oh, you're going you're going to school. Okay. Let's make it a secret when they come here and when they come here blam we trap them. Oh my gosh. Ew! Ew! Don't say ew! Ew! What is happening in my chat? Now say nice things to Apple. What the fuck? School after year 12. Understandable. Why did I respond like that? Understandable. <laughs> that is how school works. Ew! Ew! No. No, I refuse. I refuse, guys. None of that. None of that. I'm drinking my water. I did the black unicorn by Audre Lorde for the design. I drew the BLM fist, but instead of it being whole, it was the poem written in the shape of a fist. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. The only thing is that I have to like storyboard like, like as if it's like a film. So it has to be like, like, mul like I'd have to draw like multiple things. No, that did make sense. That did make sense. I was going to say to Apple something about eating them, but I didn't want to send them into orbit. <laughs> what? My mic cut out. What? Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, so I have to pick a poem that's, like, got, like, a fucking story in it somewhere. It can't just be, like, a metaphor. Unless it's, like, a story about a metaphor. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Rip Audrey Lord. I feel like I am- I should definitely know who that is, but I do not. My apologies. But you said she, like, wrote your poem, I think. And without safe words, no! I've never once felt safe here. Christina, no! <laughs> what can I do better? What can I do better? How can I fix it? Ban Vushker, I'll do it right now. I'm doing my job well then? Oh my god, Vushker. Edgar Masters, Spoon River Anthony. What? What, are, what does that combination of words mean? I'm just kidding, Apple. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Christina. Oh my gosh. I've been banned. Yep, Vushker's banned. Anthology? What are you saying, Day Day? What- why are you saying these words to me? It's a book of poems. They all have a story. Oh. Hang on. I read that as edging masters and I was like, same? <laughs> oh my god. One of the most renowned black feminist poets. Oh shit. I definitely should know who that is. I'm bad with names. Um. I'm just gonna copy what you said and paste it. I can't spell, but I'm well read. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I have to like buy it. I need like a freely accessible poem. I come here to wreak havoc. Both of those words don't look real. And havoc you do wreak, Christina. A lot of people come here to wreak havoc, okay? Because I like my- ow. I like my chaos. I like my chaos vibes, okay? Are there any specific poems you prefer? Sad, happy, motivational, etc. I like the sad shit. I like the depressing- depressing ass shit. That's what I like to hear. It's not new. Not online? I didn't see it. It said you have to, like, buy it. I do, Vushker. I like the depressing ass poems. Because that's what I write. Um. Okay, fine, Apple love advice section when? 
That would be the saddest shit in this stream. <laughs> I'm talking about poems. Uh, the two-headed calf. What? Is that a poem? I need to like be pulling these up. And it would attract cute bisexual girls, which we do not talk about. Which you're talking about right now, Vushker. Oh my god, I'm opening my files on stream. My IRL ha says I have a punishment coming and I'm uh-oh worried. Um, uh, Christina! <laughs> I'm worried for you. I'm worried for you, girl. Read that poem right now. The two-headed calf. The two-headed calf is a good one. What did I walk into? I don't know what's going on right now, Toast. The vibes are off. But the vibes are never on here. I always want the vibes to be off. Why worried? I'm assuming you're talking to Christina. Oh, oh no. You've been kicking up a fuss. Okay, wait. The two-headed cat, fuck, cat, fuck, calf, poem. 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 Is it by Laura Gilpin? It's quite short, if this is it. See more at, wait, is this it? Wait, hang on, let me show you. Sad, depressing. There's an artist called Ren who did a poem called For Joe about his friend who unalived himself. It's beautiful, beautiful, sad, and sweet. Could I storyboard it though? Is the question. Let's look at the two-headed calf first. Yeah, you could, okay. For Joe. Let me open that in another tab. For Joe poem. Okay. Is it by- who'd you say it was by? Is it by Timothy Barton? I'm gonna click on it. Okay, okay, okay. Now let me open chat so I can see you guys while I'm looking at this shit. Um, okay. Tomorrow, when the farm boys find this freak of nature, they will wrap his body in a newspaper and carry him to the museum. But tonight he is alive and in the north field with his mother. It is a perfect summer evening, the moon rising over the orchard, the wind in the grass, and as he stares into the sky, there are twice as many stars as usual. I like it. I worry that it might be too short, but I will keep it open. Now we have for Joe. This one's a little longer. For Joe is by Ren. You can YouTube Ren for Joe live. What does that mean? For Joe is by Ren. So it's not this one. Bye toast, bye toast. It's more of a performance. Like I said, I do need it in a written format. Can I find it in a written format? Let me see. Oh, it's lyrics? Oh shit, it's long. Burn on, born, burn, fuck, I can't read. Burn on. Burn, burn, burn on. Burn, burn, burn. Someone died before they lived, just has three years of I worry that he would- my teacher would say I can't use this because it's technically like a song. P 
people make le people make le storyboards of it all the time if you hit images on two-headed calf you'll see mad art and tattoos and shit okay can we post links um yes you may don't abuse it though or i will turn it off <laughs> but yes you may oh hello um <clears throat> I do like the two-headed calf. Um, the fuck you mean I always abuse links? Shut up, Vushker. And you love my links? Ew, why does that sound weird, Mr. Podcast? It's the only poem I know by name. The two-headed calf. You're the only one who made it weird. I'm sorry, but when I read it out loud, it was weird, okay? You're officially weird now. Thank you. I really try. Um, poems database. I was looking at... I, I do like a good um, Edgar Allan Poe. Um, I was looking at Sylvia Plath stuff, but I never actually, like, I pulled up a list, but I never actually looked at it. Um, browse poems. Blonde bombshell. Don't weird me. Oh my gosh. I also kind of wanted to ask if I could do a poem that I wrote, but then it would feel too personal, so I don't think I'm going to do that. Um, and all my poems are sad as shit, so I, I would really bring the mood down, you know? I'm looking here. I'll show you guys what I'm looking at. Yo, do you remember my tear reading where you said I may get some money from this girl that I ain't really like? She cashed up me like $75 last night for no reason. Oh my god, that's crazy. That's wild. Last night was the new moon, by the way, guys. I cleansed my whole apartment and everything. It was nice. But that's crazy, Jacob. Um, I feel like I need to tilt you down a little bit. Okay, anyways. I'm gonna read this one. I was born happy not knowing about what. Like Ahab's hat, I ought to be shrunk. To a speck and be dropped by beak into the sea. I have it coming to me the way I went melancholy at the wedding and slunk off to sleep. Okay, these words are too big. <laughs> Dandelions. I love dandelions. Welcome, children of the spring. In your garbs of green and gold, lifting up your sunken heads on the verdant plain and wold. What the fuck does that mean? Since when do you say that's wild? I say it all the time, at least I think. Spent it on gas and now she's blocked. <laughs> oh no. Oh, you're in an ad. I'm sorry. What the fuck is that emoji? <laughs> you do not? Okay, I've I've never like thought about saying it. So like I either say it all the time, like without noticing, or Okay, I don't like this database. Let's look at let's go to where wherever I was. List of Sylvia Plathos. I'm keeping the two-headed calf open. I'm 
Join for free? I don't want to join nothing. Let's do subject nature. Oh, this is the same shit that I was looking at. Dandelions is a big word. That's not what I said, sub sorcerer. Gotta go smoke sesh at 11. Okay, bye, Jacob. She really liked to cook. Who? Who likes to cook? Not me. <sighs> Here we go. Here's a list. Let's just pick a name that looks interesting. I think the one I wanted to look at... What about bitter strawberries? Oh, hello. What? <laughs> All morning in the strawberry field, they talked about the Russians. Squatted down between the roads, we listened. We heard the head woman say, bomb them off the map. Horseflies buzzed, paused, and stung, and the taste of strawberries turned thick and sour. Mary said slowly, I've got a fella old enough to go, if anything should happen. So it's about war. I'm sorry guys, war bores me. <laughs> like, old wars? Old wars. Like, I learn about them once, and then I'm done. Does that make sense? Oh, Plath? She would really get into it. She was a she was a cooker. No, you love wars. We have one every stream. Me and you have a war every stream. You think that highly of yourself. Um candles. They're all so long, bro. Dark house. Death and Co. That's funny. Two. Of course there are two. It seems perfectly natural now. The one who never looks up, whose eyes are lidded and bald like Blake's, who exhibits the birthmarks that are his trademark. The scald scar of water. The nude ven vendigris? Vendigris? Of the condor. I am red meat. <laughs> his beak collapsed side sidewise. I am not his yet. He tells me how badly I photograph. He tells me how sweet the babies look. Okay. These poems are like... I need something more visual. It's a joke, Apple. She stuck her head in the oven. Oh. I don't know these things. I could make a compilation, but I'm not gonna. See, there's no proof. Insomniac. Oh god, it's so long. <sighs> I just saw Egg Rock and I clipped. Clicked, <laughs> not clipped. Let's just go to, like, images and see. Heavy woman. She unalived herself with the oven. I see. I see. 
If you dissect a bird to diagram the tongue, you'll get you'll cut the cord articulating song. If you flay a beast to marvel at the mane, you'll wreck the rest from which the fur began. If you pluck out the heart to find what makes it move, you'll halt the clock that syncopates our love. Poems that tell a story. How do you not know this? I, I just- I feel like I learned that at some point, but I just don't remember. Like, I just forget things. That aren't necessarily relevant to me. Um, and a random lady sticking her head in an oven? Guess I forgot, sorry. Edgar Allan Poem. I just thought of that. Narrative poems, that's what I'm looking for. Family friend poems. The Three Little Pigs, Cinderella. These are not poems. Annabelle Lee. Oh, I remember this one. It's long as hell. I don't like that one. Was the night before Christmas. The pig. The spider and the fly. Oh my god, that's so long. The raven? Why are they so long? Narrative poems. Let's look at Edgar, Edgar Allen poems, Edgar Allen po poems. All I can remember is that one about the heart beating under the stairs or whatever. Annabelle Lee, of course. Oh, the raven is his too? The conqueror worm. Lo, tis a gala night within the lonesome latter years. Ugh. I thought this said the balls. <laughs> it's the bells. El Dorado. The Valley of Unrest. <sighs> Once it smiled a silent dell where the people did not dwell. They had gone unto the wars, trusted to the mild-eyed stores. Nightly from their azure towers to keep watch above the flowers. In the midst of which all day. <laughs> Why am I singing? The red light sun lazily lay. Now each visitor shall confess the sad valley's restlessness. Nothing there is motionless, nothing there is boring. That palpitate like the chill seeds. Seeds? Can I read? Let me see, let me just google poem about, poem about, what should I, guys, fill in the blank. Poem about blank. I like, what are things I like? I like spiders, I like snakes, I've always wanted to touch a snake, but I never have. Poem about cottage core snack. Snakes. Snakes. Snake poems. To the snake. Snake. 
green snake when I hung you round my neck and stroked your cold pulsing throat as you hissed to me glinting arrowy gold scales and I felt the weight of you on my shoulders and the whispering silver of silver of your dryness sounded close at my ears green snake i swore to my companions that certainly you were harmless but truly i had no certainty and no hope only desiring to hold you for that joy which left a long wake of pleasure as the leaves moved and you faded into the pattern of grass and shadows and i returned smiling and haunted to a dark morning the fuck does that mean Trump reads the snake poem. What is this? I'm getting distracted. Is this about- Oh, is this where Don't Tread On Me came from? Okay, I actually don't care. I've decided. I thought maybe it would be funny, but... No snake, snack. I'm not looking up snack. You weird little... Millennial core. Doggo core. Whatever. <laughs> A narrow fellow in the grass occasionally rides. You may have met him, did you not? His notice sudden is. The grass divides as with a comb, a spotted shaft seen. Not the shaft. And then it closes at your feet and opens further on? He is like a boggy acre, a floor too cool for corn. Yet when a child and barefoot, I more than once at morn, have passed, I thought, a whiplash unbraiding in the sun. When stooping to secure it, it wrinkled and was gone. Several of nature's people I know, and they know me. I feel for them a transport of cordiality, but never met this fellow attended or alone without a tighter breathing and zero at the bone. That's just about a snake, like I need. I need something visual. Uh, snake by D.H. Lawrence. Don't tread on me was a revolutionary battle flag. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks for the info, Dede. What was that even? I don't know. I don't know, Bushka. Um. This is again just about a snake. You know what poem I have been thinking about is like the one on TikTok that was like about a spider and it was like to be killed for the crime of being small or something. I want to see about spider. Maggots swimming in sodium hypochlorite. What? Once there was a water dragon. Where am I? The spider in the shower. There once was a girl, girl named Caroline. Caroline was very lonely as she did not have a family or any friends. Caroline read a lot, which made her feel less lonely, but books couldn't love her back. One day, Caroline decided she would make friends. She went to school. Okay, whatever. Spirit of the spider. John Cena. <laughs> what? 
there's, there's, there, there, spider once, spider sad, spider fuck. Small child? I shouldn't have used that word. I could have used any other word. Spider, uh, shit, small child. Spider prad. Spider crawl into dead child. Lay baby spider. Mommy pick up child. <laughs> what is this? There once was a man from... Don't play with spider eggs. Get childed on? Oh my god, you guys. My girlfriend turns into a spider. Okay, I don't know what... Can I just write my own poem? Like, I would much rather do that than sift through other people's poems, TBH. Um, spider poems. I already saw the Will You Walk Into My Parlor one. Memorize poem cobwebs. Little fairy kerchiefs spread on the grass to dry. Little fairy hammocks swinging branches high. Spider sewed at night without an arc of light upon an arc of white. It, if roughly goes there. Spider as an artist has never been employed. <laughs> Okay, I thought I- I thought I heard revive. I thought I heard revive. There once was an apple with a style- This is something you'd write? <laughs> what? Please. There once was an apple with a style that drapple, infamous as a marble, destined to dapple. Why did you use marble? Your sounds got asked. Whatever. Um... I just want to see if there's more to this poem. Is that it? These are so short. They're too short. What if I look up gay poems? Marble cause you do mewing? No, you still unalienable? I've only heard that word used in, like, the Constitution. We hold these unalienable rights... Or whatever. <laughs> you complaining about small is funny? How did I complain about small? Okay, Constantinopia fan. What the fuck are you on about, Bushka? I just don't have the patience for you right now. A nearsighted spider once spun her silk, hoping to snag a fly or its ilk. Ilk? The web she wove was large and sticky and hard to see, which made it tricky. The moon was casting a golden glow upon the nocturnal life below. In the light, she thought she spied her prey and laughed. This is my lucky day. Oh, a tasty morsel I see. Fat and round and all for me. But this was not her lucky day. Instead, she had become the prey. Eek! The spider cried in vain. Her blurry meal was now made plain. Myopic vision was her curse. She knew her night could not be worse. What she'd mistaken for a fly was a pair of witches coming nigh. A spider was just the thing they needed to ensure their bubbling brew succeeded. They plucked the spider web and all from the window in the wall and stirred her in with some molasses. I bet she'd wish- I bet she wished she'd gotten glasses. 
Silly! Okay, I'll keep that one because it's silly. So we have the two-headed calf and this one. These are too small. I said short, like they're not long enough. That's not the same thing. And I'm also not one centimeter tall, I'm five foot nine. To be self elevant el fuck. <laughs> I can't talk or read today. To be self el elephant Amazing. Why am I foot man now? Why am I a man with a foot thing? A foot fetish, if you will. I do not have one of those. And I am not male either. Either. <laughs> either. I'll keep this one because I can like kind of see see like what I could storyboard for it. Um poems. That's not what I didn't want to look up all that. Poems. No, not poems T. Oh my god. Poems. Okay, foot woman. I'm not a- I'm- I'm not- 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 I'm not a man or a woman. I'm nothing. I always knew you had a foot fetish. I don't. Nobody. Apple at 6 a.m. Mmm, one single toe. I don't do that. Okay, nothing. Thank you. That's better. I'm like that one guy in that Greek myth who said his name was nothing or nobody or whatever. A line storm. Oh, uh, oh uh, my god. Gay poems. Dun 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 na, 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 na. Gay poems. I sing the body electric. Walt Whitman. The armies of those I love engirth me and I engirth them. I don't know what engirth means, but I don't like the way the word looks. I respect your Greek beliefs and your low height. Gay poems opens Tumblr and Twitter. Engirth. You better get engirth. <laughs> no! Okay, this is him thirsting after a, a boat father. <laughs> a boat father. Bro, if you don't stop that, I'm gonna engirth you. Oh my god, I can see myself using this for a while. Please, no. These are long. Dear Gay Bashers. The night we got bashed, we told Rusty how they drove up, yelled queer, and threw a hot dog, sped off. Now is that gay bashing or are they just calling you queer? Good point. This is not a poem. <laughs> this is like a story. I can feel my necklace turning around. <laughs> Sounds hot. <laughs> oh my god. If someone asked me who did I get that from, I must say nothing to. Dear gay bashers, you should change your Discord name to gay basher. <laughs> oh my god.
What if I find a lesbian love poem? A little love compassion. I can't draw that. It's cute though. Heliotropism. Mm, love is too abstract. I can't draw it. When your necklace has more flexibility than your neck. Cute bisexual girl low poem to attract the cute bisexual girl's mewing technique. Videos 100% true. Download cracked without ads. Download now. What the fuck? Voyages. The mortician in San Francisco. Voyages. Oh, brilliant kids, frisk with your dog. Fondle your shells and sticks. <laughs> what? Why would you say fondle? What is going on? I'll use the rest of your stream to edit the parody version of your bipolar video. I haven't worked in a F Apple video in a long while. Okay, if you if you will, if you shall. Did she lactate again? Milk brought down by a girl's kiss? What? What? My eyes and groin are permanently swollen. I'm alternatingly brilliant and witless and sleepless. Bed is just a swamp to roll in. Although I'd cream my jeans touching your breast. Sweetheart. It isn't lust, it's all the rest. Get me out of here! Wow, read that to class. <laughs> no, please, no. No. Homosexuality. Cut and dry. I start like ice, my finger to my ear, my ear to my heart, the proud cur at the garbage can. In the rain. Blah, blah, blah. Gay Pride Weekend? Body without the D. Oh boy. That took me a second. Glitter in my wounds, that's fun. Heterosexuals. Heterosexuals need to see our suffering. Oh wait, this is actually really serious. <laughs> the violent deaths of our friends and lovers. To know glitter on a queer is not to dazzle, but to unsettle the foundation of this murderous culture. Defiant weeds smashing up through cement. You think Oscar Wilde was funny. Well, darling, I think he was busy distracting straight people so they would not kill him. If you knew how many times I've been told, you're not like my gay best friend who tells me jokes and makes me laugh. No, I sure as fuck am not. I have no room in my life to... Is this, like, shaped like something? I have no room in my life to audition for your pansy mascot and peop you people can't kill me and think you can kill me again! While standing in a line for death, I am fanning my hot pussy with your new book. Will you sign it next week, my fearless F-word sister? 
Oh, wow. If you have, if it has the word heterosexuals in it, you know it's serious. How do you even miss that? Oh my god. My erotic double. What? On Earth, we're briefly gorgeous. Whoa, 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 it's long. It's long. That's what she said. I realized that all my jokes lately that I've been cutting, like, out of my videos and putting onto TikTok are, like, they're, like, all dirty jokes. And I'm, like, well, well. Since when has my sense of humor been that crude, if you will? You have been extremely inumen- inuen- inuendo-y. inuendo, -y. inuendo -y. <laughs> I know, right? I never expected apple nuendos. I want to know what lisp is. My hand inside my neighbor's waistband. Let me. <laughs> now, when I say please, let me suck your cock. I sound straight as the still second hand on a dead watch. <laughs> what the fuck? It's f you've been hanging out with Blaney. Oh my god, you're so real for that. It's fine. More innuendos, more possibility for cute BSGS. Bees G's. Which we do not talk about. Oh, okay. This is a dirty stream. I know, I was just looking at poetry, bruh. Bruh, I was hymen. I'm not clicking on that. Lady of the Moon. Oh, this is an article. It's a secrete. I don't know who needs to hear this. Other than me, but the moon will never leave. You, you are good enough for the moon and the moon is good enough for you because you are here and the moon is there and every time the moon is supposed to be there and it isn't interesting. Brother, brother, be, be, did you mean became? Became non-family friendly no more? I've never been family friendly. Apple mother gonna come here and spank your ass with a shoe? The moon won't swoon to the sound of your doubloon, you little goon. See, I just wanna write a poem, cause I write, I like writing poems. And then I can just draw it. Do people still use emoticons? Are- is that- are you talking about like when you make a face with like text and stuff? Cause yeah, people still use those sometimes. Yeah, writing then? If you make it too sad, we can stop you. I don't think I'm allowed to write it though. I think it has to be a poem that was already written. But like, I have poems that are already written too. Essay on boyhood. Fable. 
I'm tired of meaning, says the tortoise, to the hare who agrees. The lions and crows don't disagree, and the snake chimes in. It would be better if we didn't have to moonlight as morality lessons. Exactly, says the chicken. I'd like to let loose once in a while. I'd like to stretch my wings, she says. Yes, says the fox. You should get out of your pen more, says the fox. You should let me help, says the fox, opening the latch to the evening. It was a fine evening and a fine conclusion they were coming to, thought the fox, helping the chicken out of her feathers. What? Say you found it on the deep web. <laughs> there once was a man from Nantucket. It tells a story. Maybe writing the poem will make you more engaged and then with all the inspiration you can make a throwaway one with your Googled poems. Well, I already have the spider one, the spider's curse, which I think I could draw. And then this one, which I think maybe I could draw, but it's it might be too short. Sauerkraut festival. Sauerkraut ice cream from a tiny paper cup. I bled through the entire month of April. My doctor named this weeping. What? You will tell your babies someday. Mad. <laughs> oh, it's a mad lib. There was once a man from Nantucket. Okay, hang on. I can't see behind this. There once was a man from Nope, it didn't. Man took it. Oh. I see lyrics. Maybe writing the poem will make you- oh. The spider curse will steal your purse like Apple riding a moose in the middle of a stream starting to snooze. What are you saying? What are you saying? Okay. <laughs> Stop rhyming. Don't rhyme all the time. In my chat, you little rat. <laughs> I don't see it. Like, it's not coming up. It's a limerick. I don't know if I can do limericks. Oh, that's really short. That's definitely too short. Thank you, Doe. So I have the spider curse. This one. And then I'm still looking to see if there's one that I actually want. See, this is inspirational. We can convert it to a national. A national? What's a national? Okay, this isn't what I want. Let's just look.
Let me look up umbrella. When I push your button, you fly off the handle. Old skin and bones, black bat wing. We're like you and I, both of us resemble my mother. This is about an umbrella. Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella, eh, eh. Under my umbrella, Ella. Tell me, umbrella mongers, when has an umbrella ever kept the rain and the mist from entering a heart and shaking it with dreams? When has it kept the rain and the mist from entering a heart and breaking it? What? Mussolini's umbrella! Umbrella handles. Circumambulate. They that dally nicely with words may quickly make them wanton? I'm tired. Night, night. Good night, day, day. Have a good sleep. Now you really sound like a moose. What time is it? Did you take stuff? I'll take it after stream. I don't feel like getting it right now. Thari blows plus tusks. Let's go to page four. Oh, Maros. This has potential. Is it raining, Mary? Can you see? I hear rain. Is the road black? Is it shining? Dark, I can see for myself. Put on my red tie. Red has life in it. Most men I know dress like undertakers, making sure they look mournful enough to manage their own funerals. Oh! No accounting for taste. We should be grateful for that. Help me get to the window. I want to see Mickle Street. Mickle? Wow. Please? Pretty please? No. Um, 
Don't you hear it now? Something like rain off in the distance. My ear maybe is playing me tricks again. There was a rushing like rain when it moves closer and starts a mill stream in the trees. No, I guess my senses must be losing their touch. It was nothing then, nothing more nothing more than a tantrum of the boneyard best for me oh this is long to hold still in this chair and listen to my beard grow now if hair was poetry then your walt whitman would be a great success i wear out trying to come to terms with the wrong weather what might you call speaking terms i don't want to talk too much else you tell them to go home marry no visitors today or just one what else is a red tie for never mind Sappho. I think of that song that goes, Is that Sappho you're reading? The mice come in, the kitchen blown with cold. I keep the house and say no words. It is true, I am twisted as the cactus that gnarls and turns beside the milky light that cuts the fingers easily and means nothing. Oh my god, don't do my intro to me. Don't do my intro to me, Vushkar. For all the pain that shoots along the hand, I dust the feathers down the yellow thorns. I light the stove. The gas curls around. Oh, this is a good one. It's long as hell, though. It's way too long. Is that even your house? Is that Sappho you're reading? Sleep, little baby, clean as a nut. Bat. The hunting of the snark. <sighs> I can't think of any, like, poems or poets right now. Okay, fine, I'll read Blonde Bombshell. Huge, she is a blizzard, a huge spook. Galoshes, she bulges like a deuce coop. What does that mean? ASMR. ASMR. Why are there ASMR poems? I'm sorry I was engrossed in the moment. You just rhymed for like seven hours. Oh my god. You got this? Oh my god. Nail hard. What is this? As I was saying, your- your death ain't mine. I sprout anyhow. 
Idea of soul flourish ting. Just, just, ish. The s Wait, I can play it? Wait, hang on. Hello. My name is Sonia Dupuis and I am a saint from Cairo. I am Cuba. I can't hear that shit. Anyway. You got this fine two apple! Thank you for the the motivation. What did I just say? Once while disemboweling the chicken. Okay. Phosphorus. Okay, dude, what? The sun was losing. L, take the L, sun. Seeing a UFO and singing Frank Sinatra's Fly Me to the Moon into the Night at the top of my lungs. <laughs> How many poems does a guy have to write to get abducted by aliens? <laughs> aliens? Aliens, did you write this? Hi, Toast. Do you know any good poems or poets that are visual that I could storyboard? I know you see me the same as the fat moon peeping through the trees like a pervert. I know you see me! Same as the fat moon peeping through the trees like a pervert. I just want to talk. My arms are sore from waving. My dad used to wonder why I was always so fascinated with space. Then learned I share a birthday with Yuri Gagarin. And then it, that, that explained everything. I would watch that shit show Ancient Aliens with my mom and she would say, You know when... God, I don't know how to say that. Guate, we remember where the Mayas came from. Raising her eyebrows into orbit. How could I not grow up to search the skies for meaning? Ancient peoples thought objects soaring through the atmosphere were celestial serpents, their glowing tails slithering through space. That's so me for real? No, I don't read. Oh. It's very apparent because you spelled read wrong. <laughs> I'm kidding. But you did. Um... What the fuck is this word? Is that you? I feel like the last kid sitting in front of the school waiting to be picked up. Don't say you've forgotten me. That was a ride. You missed some scary poems about sucking cock. <laughs> ah. uh No, you wrote it grammatically, Grammy. What the fuck? Why is this so hard to do? I wrote. Also, cock? <laughs> A doodle do, you know? <laughs> like. What? Little Ant, my South Texas bowman. Words like weeds. The crazy woman, women of Plaza de Mayo. I don't understand this one. Let's skip to page eight. Mama said wedding grounds. 
Oh my gosh. Uh. I'm just clicking on random ones at this point. In this life, there are stars and there are stunt doubles. Before I became one of those fathers obsessed with memorizing his lines, making peace with the big director in the sky who doesn't like ad-libs. Before all that, I was the star of my own low-budget soap opera. Unsweetened coconut flakes. Once my father was cast as twins. What? That summer I got very thin of on my diet of he loves me not, kale, fried egg, a tomato melted in butter. And when I was flat enough, oh, this is triggering. <laughs> Gin and the ring, ring, ring of that unanswered phone. Each week, I bought a new bottle of vinegar, which is delicious slopped on hot white bread. Who with a tongue hasn't loved some sweet slow rot? You catch flies with it too. Put a drop in the base of a jam jar. It was plum. I ate it straight off the spoon. Cover tight with plastic wrap with the tip of the knife. Make a hole too small to get out. They drown, but who hasn't needed to watch some smaller things suffer? That summer, I scrubbed and rinsed with it, too. I had read somewhere you can break oven e open even a rock if you pour enough vinegar on. What? When I was six years old. Here I stand. I don't know if that's actually a song. I just kind of made that up. Water's lubricous edges. Water of jellyfish. Lacteal sinuous water. Sinuous water. Water of lubricant. I can't fucking read. Who let them write? I know, like, what is going on here? Glassy thickness. Deliquescence. Indelectable contours. Sumptuous water. This is just about water into the weeds, the brutality of those two men who broke into an apartment and murdered her boyfriend, then as she stepped from the shower, shot her two right in the face so she crumbled over the back bathtub. What? My eyes! I mean, not my eyes, my mind's eye, imagining that. A toothless crackhead was the mascot. An outline for a film. Gdansk. Bro got girthed by lubricant. <laughs> Lubricus? Nar. Nar. Jaws. The animatronic shark? This is my blood type. Blah, 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 blah. Girl, are you a shark? Were you a shark in your past life? Girl, were you a shark in your past life? Cause... <laughs> I can't think of anything. <laughs> Girl, were you a shark in your past life? Cause you look like you need some blood. <laughs> what does that even mean? What have I just said? Mama's boy? Ooh. Uh... I stood on the ledge. 
Mm -hmm. Of the bathroom sink. Much different than where I thought we were going. Are you rizzing the fucking poems? I am. RJ, I'm not sure if sharks got iron issues too. Hey, yeah. Someone could say that to me and it would work. No, it wouldn't work. I'd be really confused. I wouldn't understand. <laughs> Why are they standing on the ledge of the bathroom sink? Like how- I'm imagining them literally standing on the fucking sink. Like, you'd have to- what the fuck are you doing? You might get confused, but they said correct information. No, I do need some more blood. I could use some more blood. I don't think I'd be making them red blood cells fast enough. Pubic- wait, are they standing on the sink because they're cutting their pubes? Where am I? A mouthful of Apple Jacks. Oh my god. Personal forest. Ew, for- Oh, now I get it. Oh my god. America, I am. It is me and my trophy wife. There is a bat. <laughs> How is that a biography? Can you describe your years in prison? Dream walking ballad, November Sunday morning. Religion, living activities, arts and science. Uh, funerals. Memorial Day. Christmas. Let's try activities. Lil Mermaids. Why is that like the rapper name for Ariel? Rinsing the seesaw out of our bikinis. The drinking water and getting a slap upside the head. Oh. Jesus on the Iron Cross, the strongest boy in our high school. In my next life, let me be a tomato. Lusting and unafraid in this bipedal incarnation, I have always been scared of my own ripening. Mother standing outside the fitting room door. I only became bright after Bloody Mary's. Only hole in New Jersey summers where beefsteaks like baubles sag in the yard where we pass down heirlooms in thin paper envelopes i'm bored Tomatoes are lusty? The fuck? What kind of tomatoes she eating? They are kind of busty, not gonna lie, bro. What are you on about? Don't talk about tomatoes like this. Okay, I would do this one, but I don't want to have to say mommy. Because I think we have to do like a voiceover of it. We are the undead. Uh, it 
touch the face of God. This sounds like being manic. Just say mother in like a really monotone voice. <laughs> no, no. I think I have to like do the poem how it's meant to be done. I love rabbits, you're supposed to say. Around a bonfire. Admit it, you love rabbits. What? What is this about? Admit it! You love rabbits! Jeez! After the meal. Knees of elephants? A ghetto full of charred men? Wow. The garlic. Rabbi of condiments. What is this? Guys, I'm having trouble. I might just go with the stupid spider one. The one about the spider not being able to see. When a bullet enters the brain, the head explodes. Okay, that's about dead people. the knuckles though his hand was bare though their hands were bare I remember the impressions left on this skin the wilting and welting I don't remember the sound not one smack I remember the falls myself falling to the floor or sidewalk or against a brick wall after met at my wow my head met after a push there were many pushes. Girls pushed, but I punched. Pulled one down by the hair and kneed her as my head bled. Girls didn't punch until high school. I had always punched. What kind of girl are you? The kind who wants to live, as I, I said. And I didn't want... Uh, this is too long. It was interesting, though. Spring break! We're riding in this teal convertible, the clouds just dozing. Dad drives my sisters in front, I lay my head on mom's lap in the back. I lay my head on her lap as he drives this teal convertible that was rented special just for these four days in Albuquerque. In it, we are open to the whole world, to the whole sky. And I know right now I can see that these are the best clouds in the business. The best clouds in the business. I could use that one. I can kind of see that one. I'll open it in another tab, just in case. The floating baby! The summer you learn to swim! Oh my god. You forgot to say sugar. So I said, come on sugar, you can do it. What? Sugar. 
Sugar. I could maybe draw that one. I don't know. That kid is weird, says the teacher, flipping her shining hair. I don't know where he's at. Indeed, he is quiet, in the way of a giraffe. Ears tuned to something we can't hear, he turns his sleepy eyes on me, chocolate brown with long, extraordinary lashes, as I hand him a seashell. Something to write about, you know? Something to focus on, suddenly, silently, in the mysterious way of poetry. He is at that shell, he is in it, his heart fills up with it. Oh shell, he writes, you make lizards dance in the sky with birds. Never leave me, shell. <laughs> During sharing time, he reads his poem aloud, reverently, almost to himself. Half the class is stunned, half embarrassed. The teacher shakes her head. I am barely breathing. One of us, I sing. One of us. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? One of us. One of us. My neck hurts, y'all. Like a lot. They ignored the new boy, snickering behind his back. In silence, I stayed safe, my lips pressed together. Growing bolder, they pierced him with arrow-sharp words. I pretended I hadn't heard. They twisted his arms. One word escaped his lips before they dragged him out of sight, out of earshot. Cowards! I ran away. All the words I didn't say haunt me every day. Bystander. Bystander syndrome. Now your neck even hurts if you move it like a stiff tabloon. Brother, give me some push ups? No, no push ups. Stomp. I come home. Guys, this is boring! I'm bored! But I have to pick one. Donuts in kid jail. Here's how often you see donuts in kid jail. Never. Zero. Zero times. Like seeing a cat or a dog. A cell phone. A white kid. A comfy chair. Just me and this one kid. Same kid who wrote Monkey Rescue the first time we wrote together. No donuts for kids in kid jail. I talked to the students in jail about freedom. Let's see, what are you about? It has something to do with guns and fireworks. Harley Davidson's New Hampshire, living free until you're dead. I tell the students I think the people fetishizing freedom don't mean it. That they really mean look over here, away from all the slavery you did. We did. Away from all the jail. I tell them they are the experts. Ask them to write what freedom means. Privacy is freedom. I can't draw this one. It's cool, though. Ow! Whoopsie. Why are these all about jail now? Oh, let's see if there are health and illness ones. I can relate to that. Migraine as a whale, a triptych. Your was bent? <laughs> I cannot. I simply cannot. The fuck happened? I don't know. Was bent made me laugh. I just clicked on this one because it said migraine and I get those. Whale husband. I know, I was like, what's a husband? Service huge. All day you scan the horizon for humpback whales until the cabin cuts in. Surface tension gives way to the whale's bumpy turbid colds. Toxic. 
میشستم Watching the horizon hurts her. The horizon lies. Even the ocean's iris awakens. My opic. Awakens myopic. What is this? A whale huge moving into midnight. Her throat grooves. Other parties everywhere you go. You miss your body. What? Interesting. Can't draw it though. Well, maybe I can. Wait, I can draw maybe the original one. About the whales. Everyone has one. I like this one. <laughs> I think Wasbind is really funny. But, um... It might just be a typo. But also they keep it, like, in all the things. But I could draw- I could draw, like, the story of, like, whale watching people. That would be kind of hard for me to draw, though. Interesting. They made one about me. Go back. Oh, toast. Said my illness. <laughs> I'm tired of being serious all the time. I don't like how you treat me like we haven't shared the same apartments for 18 years long enough to be considered married in some places. Happy anniversary to one. I says. Anyways, who's counting? What? I think they're like you and they misspell things. Like, read. <laughs> Sorry, I'm mean when I'm live. <laughs> um. Yeah. Nuh -uh. Ew. Sorry, I didn't mean to just ew you like that. Include the fact of Ronald Reagan that he had a birthday. <laughs> Too short. Oops, I clicked on three. The pendulum. The mice are sheltering in place in our walls. I know that now because of the nights I can't sleep. I, I know that now because of the nights I can't sleep. Stewing over the news, my body vibrating with phantom pain of the thousands intubated, suffocating. I hear the rapid heartbeat skittering like an infection in the house. Ow. Before we saw one walking almost calmly across the table and set a trap under the hutch. Last night, I thought I'd never call my mind with best estimates of global deaths reaching 2 million. When was this written? Is this COVID? May 2021. May 2021. Is this COVID? Oh, they're doing tests on mice. What? I feel like this is COVID. That's why favorite streamer. You forgot a word. Transcript of Psych Ward Guard 3. Erasure poem in which I am the white space. Why 
What? Who are you talking about? The doctor? He's awful. The meanest. How much do you weigh? I could bench you. Wouldn't even break a sweat. The only difference between me and you is I'm wearing this badge. I've got my problems, just like you. Believe me. And sure, you've got yours. Once in a while, I've lost my temper. I've been wrong. I've said some hurtful things. The only difference is you go to your breaking point. You got to your breaking point. That that doesn't make you crazy. We all have breaking points. This is not really a poem. Four years after diagnosis. The singing pills. What is this? I spit up the pills that look like pills, place them back inside the orange safety bottle, place the bottle next to vitamins, aspirin, glue, then hit the backspace key and delete. The scene now, chroma white and starry, evening retreats into the day and the light, does not yet hurt. I smile all day long and erase the trance of fire. Each time it erupts, delete, delete. And each of my dead holds a torch inside me, bubbling up my throat, lungs gummed with creosote. I reverse into the early morning blanketry. Good night, toast. Thanks, thanks. Good night. When the pills still sing me to sleep, deep in the blue milk of oblivion, all of my wicks for the moment unlit, the laundry impiles absence of bodies. Each version of myself is a day collapsed in a flowered basket, half fog, half sludge, half twinkling. My chemical sleep ordered at the drugstore. My pharmacist, my god, my automatic refill. Please quell and quiet and quiet me. I am an ordinary I unfree from history. What? I kinda like this one. wanted to look at this one. This one's too short. Domestic violence. Recovery. Whoa. Another version of me thought every stone precious. Gave even the kitchen herbs. Herbs, excuse me. <laughs> um, names. Since September, I've been a ruined house, only newly shaken loose by echoes, chasing sentences to their ends, hurting words with a leaf blower, gentle but blunt and loud. I test the soil, I measure the temperature, I know. I've lost, but not exactly what. Weeds met, met, metastasize faster than I can pluck them. I dream of the snail shell enclosing me. I dream of a gun I can't stop firing. I knew what I was getting into. There came a day when my daughter first touched grass. Touch grass! My only job is a memory. Remember the grass with the beetles edging, edging the blades. Remember the poppy's black beauty marks. Another version of me remembers. Another version died on the bathroom floor, on my knees. In the garden, I can hear the clock bells ring. I can wield my memory like a wind willow to a pond. Make your first for her history. Love poem to the terrible doctors. Oh, play doctor, play doctor we are, as antique leaves or Cynthia trees working our roots toward the great house where the children sleep with all the lamps blown out. And you are singing, which means I am singing, which means the Cynthia trees must, blah, 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 must be shaking even through these long still days. The doctor comes into the terrible house and when he leaves, he comes into the trees and for a terrible moment is the trees. Which means we were the doctor, and that is not my life. What I do is live in the dark with you, and I will be there with you as the pumpkins fatten on the vine in the cold suit. I don't understand this one. Who spells Jacob with a K? That's weird. That's wild. What is this? 
Whoa! Listens like the fish below the ice listens to the fisherman. Medicine, he says, is not an exact science. He listens like the ice fisherman who listens to the fish. the rat since when do you say that's wild I'm pretty sure I've said it before okay you're making a big deal out of nothing Little Pharma. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, yo, what is up? Arp. That's how you wrote it, though. I could just go to sleep on the on the table right now. <laughs> Don't pass out on the table. I want to. Migraine. I get those. It comes in deep as dark, riding a nightmare. You wake, yelping. You think from your fear, but you discover the distress is caused by pain. The migraine descends, an unwished for gift, and like a not very pleasant prediction from a fortune telling. I always get scared to say that word. Pleading for it to depart never works. Better to invoke blessing. Welcome the unbidden guest. It'll get worse before it gets better. Then finally, as Emily was wise enough to foresee, after great pa pain, a formal feeling comes. Eh. Can't draw that. You gotta take stuff before passing out. I know. I know.
Okay, I could maybe use that one. A goat appeared. Diagnosis. Sorry, I'm going silent. I'm like really laser focused. <laughs> I think I'm gonna use the singing pills. Might use the singing pills. It's fine, you're doing your hustle. Now, Vushker, if you are editing a video, I'm gonna end in like two minutes, so. <laughs> if you're almost done with it, then I can wait a second and watch it before I end. Fuck it, we do it live. I'll rush it. <laughs> okay. This is scary for me to click on. Oh! <laughs> I knew where that was going and I still clicked on it. Okay, I could use this one too. This one might be more like... But wait, weren't you gonna draw on shit? I never said I was gonna draw, I just have to pick I literally just have to pick a poem. I literally just have to pick a poem. The drawing is like a later thing. I was just saying that the poem that I'm picking has to be something that I can draw. I'm not drawing it tonight. Okay, poet apple. Oh my god.
Okay, I think I'm done. I think that's enough. I can pick from those that I have. Um... Okay. <laughs> we'll wait for it, Vushka. Don't worry. We'll wait for it. Prepare your screen. Okay, I'm preparing. Chippy, chippy, chappa, chappa. See you so nice sometimes. Chippy chippy chapa chapa. Only sometimes. I know. Also, I need to show you guys next stream. I'm getting a haircut, hopefully. When I'm when I go back home. Like right before. So when I go back home, um, also, I don't know if I'm going to be able to... No, I'm just going to cut my hair a little shorter than I normally get it. But I need to show you guys... Um, my... Um, like, what I want to get is my hair cut. If I am able to. I need to show you guys next stream, so remind me. Yeah, it's showing up. Okay, girthed toe? What the fuck? Why would you name it this? Okay. Let me turn up my desktop audio so y'all can hear it. Okay. Y'all should be able to see it. Let me turn my volume up. Thank you for using the intro. Hey yo, what is up? Hey yo, what is up? Welcome to my first ever video. So I talk a lot on my so I talk a lot over on my Twitch streams. I'm live right now. Hey yo, and sometimes I get asked the same questions over and over about my no let me lo, no i paused too long <clears throat> anyways today i wanted to talk about the peaking so today i'm going to talk about so today i'm going to talk about oh my god luna looks so scary back there <laughs> she looked scary i'm not apologizing why the difference matters i'm not a doctor if i am not a doctor i'm not a doctor if you believe this may apply to you or someone you love oh good but anyways I am a doctor. Mania is defined by Google as What the fuck was that? And they get harder <laughs> Now that you understand I am a doctor. I promise depression. <laughs> I promise depression. That's good. That's good. I like that. Thank you, Vushko. Keep giving me clips. Oh my god. Now go sleep. Don't forget to take stuff. Bish. Oh my god. Oh shit. My shit's loud now. Okay. There we go. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Let's see who's live. Who's live right now? Um, we could raid official playing Valorant, or I could find someone new. What do we think? Just go do your stuff, you're sleepy anyways. And then when you raid, you feel forced to stay there. Um, no, not really. I just kind of say, like, two things. And then I go about my business. <laughs> I like to raid. It makes me feel better. 
shrugs deserved. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, get raiding then. Should we raid Fluent playing Valorant? Do we care or should I find someone that's in just chatting? I put it high to low viewers and I'm scrolling to the bottom. Just chatting is like horrible to find someone. <laughs> TVH. Oh, you just want to raid the guy that I already know? Well, you should have said that. I just know you don't like Valorant. That's why I was thinking of not doing that. Yeah, I hate Valo if you're already searching, I mean, but if it's too much of a hassle, then just don't. I still haven't found a streamer that matches your TM time. I know. We need a just chatter bestie who streams right after me. <laughs> I have one, but she hates women. No. <laughs> Unless you're kidding. No, thank you. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm thinking we just raid official. And I can find people on my own time. This person's having a two year anniversary subathon. We could raid their subathon. Should we raid this subathon? I kind of want to do it. Oh my gosh, bubbles! Sorry, they just did bubbles. Sure, sure, go ahead, subathon. <laughs> okay, okay. The artist day. Did I spell it right? Okay. Okay. You guys know what time it is. It's that time to get up close and personal with the mic. Thank you so much to everyone on Anna, but fuck. 
thank you so much to everybody and anybody who came to the stream and thank you so much to everybody and anybody who is a lovely lovely vod viewer i love you so much make sure to say hi hi before you go bye bye go tell them fine apple sent you send those okay fine apple emotes rep me good be nice and um <laughs> And make sure to check out last week's video I put out on Sunday and keep an eye out for this one coming out this next Sunday. I think you guys are like gonna like the one coming out on this next Sunday better than the last one. Um, and I love you guys. Volume up. Get ready for me to blow your eardrums with my kazoo. Bye Vushker, thanks for the new video you made today. Love you guys. I'll see you guys on Friday for some tarot. Hope everybody had a good new moon yesterday.